I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, IHS. I'm Jordan Balmier. And I'm Emma Rankin. And this is your Daily Dose for Wednesday 12, 2016. Today is Character Day. Tomorrow is Class Color Day. Freshman class colors are red and green, sophomores are orange and purple, Juniors are red and blue, and seniors are black and white. Let's show some class pride. Hey there, RHS. Last week you voted for your homecoming court. Let's go look at the 2016 winners. What was your best Spirit Week homecoming memory so far? Probably last year when we were making our float, because it took a lot of time, but it was also a lot of fun. Making the float at my house, because Jeff is like the lumberjack. So far, it was probably last year at the pep rally. I mean, competing in the games and stuff is always fun. Um, my favorite was freshman year when we had those god-awful shirts that said YOFO. You're only a freshman once. Biggest lie. What was, what was where, you, where you get to participate in all, in all the days the days in the week? Um, dressing like salad dressings with my best friends last year. My favorite is um, working on the float. The last uh, junior year, we, um, we put together a pretty decent float, kind of got robbed, we got put in third place. How did you feel when you were nominated to be on homecoming court? I was really happy and excited and like glad that my fellow classmates voted for me. I was really excited. I was in the back room and I was like, I did it. Like it, It's been something that I've always wanted to do since freshman year and I'm happy I finally made it. Um, I was pretty excited. It's going to be a fun night. Um, not thinking too much about it. Still got a couple weeks of football before the homecoming game. I was really surprised, but um, I'm really happy. Like Me and my four best girlfriends um, are all on court together, so that was really surprising. Um, I was really ecstatic when I heard like you know, that my name was called for homecoming court, and I'm really happy that people voted for me. I was super excited, and I was kind of uh, honored to be chosen by my peers to represent our class. I was so excited just because I get to be on it with my four best friends. Um, I was very excited. It was very nerve-wracking and just an exciting moment to hear your name being called. There you have it, RHS, your 2016 homecoming court. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, guys. Homecoming tickets are still on sale for $20 in the counseling office. Next week's college visits include Northern Michigan University, Concordia University, Grand Valley State University, Schoolcraft College, and Oakland University. Sign up in the CRC if you are interested in any of these colleges. Seniors, Roosevelt will be hosting a financial aid night Tuesday, October 18th at 6.30 to 8 in the cafeteria. A university financial aid representative will be here to speak with parents and pa students and parents about applying for the FAFSA, free application for federal student aid, grants, scholarships, and student loans. Examples, tips, and handouts will be provided. Let's, let us make this process easier for your family and possibly earn you some money for college. Political Science Club, SAD, Student Council, and Girls Group are meeting after school today. Tomorrow, after school, until 4 p.m., Art Club will be making mandalas. It'll be completely free. Roosevelt's Gay Straight Alliance is meeting after school today in Mr. Keith's room. New members are always welcome. Now here's Carter Coyne with your sports report. Hey Ari, just I'm Carter Coyne and this is your sports report. Varsity Soccer lost LP to 6-0. to zero. Good game by Robert White and Jonathan Gomez. We'll get them next time, Bears. Tomorrow, freshman football have an away game at Taylor Kennedy from 4 o'clock to 5 o'clock. And JV also have a game at Taylor Kennedy from 6.30 to 7.30. Remember, it's a great day to be a Bear. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Carter. Chelsea Menwear in downtown Wyandotte is hiring. Chelsea Menwear is looking for an individual to work approximately three hours a day, five days a week, doing stock and general cleanup. This is a paid position. See Mrs. Z in the CRC for more information. Book Club. Books have arrived. Members can pick up this month's book, Warriors Don't Cry, from Mr. Baker or Mr. Keast. Peer mentor applications are due today. Happy birthday to Jake Claxton, Brianna LeClaire, and Allison Walker. Hey, Emma. What? Why is Peter Pan always flying? I don't know why. Because he never lands. <laughs> Stay, Stay classy, classy RHS. RHS. Hey, Adam. My life would be blue if you didn't go with me to homecoming. So who are you guys taking to homecoming? Julia Dudas. Sarah Hayner. Yes, Noah Crosby. Yes, Zach Crosby. 
Are you guys excited to go to homecoming with them? Yes, very excited. And same. Yeah, going with the date is really fun. Yeah, I like Zach. So was it expected for you guys to be asked? Um, he told me he was going to ask me, but I didn't expect it to happen at the time it did. Yeah, because he was being kind of weird at my volleyball game. Why did you guys decide to take these girls to the homecoming? Because uh, she's hot and she's my girlfriend. Um, because she's a fun person to hang out with and we're going to have a ball at homecoming. How did you guys get asked? I got asked with a poster. Pretty traditional. I got asked with a poster and a princess ring. Are you guys aware that they look a lot alike? Yeah, I am. I have been informed. Um, are you guys aware that you look uh, a lot alike? For sure. <laughs> Told all the time, yeah. Are you guys aware that you guys are brothers? I think so, yeah. Some people have told me that. Are you guys also aware that you guys are going with brothers? <laughs> yeah. Yep. <laughs> so grab yourself a ticket for $20 and maybe even a date, and we'll catch you here at 7. That's right, all right, Jess. Get your dancing shoes on. We'll see you at homecoming.